As this rain continues to drench San Diego this work week, a beach hazard statement is in effect. Swimmers and surfers warned of potentially dangerous conditions at our local beaches. Let's get over to 10 News reporter Mimi Alcala. Live in Sunset Cliffs where some neighbors say they have even bigger concerns. Mimi. Yeah, Jason, and right now the waves are reaching four to six feet, but they are expected to get bigger on Friday. Now the neighbors here tell us that they fear some of the issues that come with that. There's, not, there's nowhere for the ocean to go. Chris Ducharme has lived in Ocean Beach for 30 years. There's caves all along the cliffs. And the signs say it all. The cliffs are unstable. He worries many properties along the coast are at risk of some big time erosion. That entire patio right behind me was all one patio about two to three weeks ago. The ocean taking its toll on the cliffs. A deck overlooking the beach from the inn at Sunset Cliffs partially collapsed a few days ago after the cliffs blow crumbled. Then you get something like that where you get a super high tide and a big, a big wave will come and like double up on itself right at that patio and at that wall. The bottom of the stairwell stolen by the ocean. Crews working to cut and remove the large pieces still hanging on before things can get worse. It is very violent down there. It's like a big washing machine on, on, on like the mixed cycle, you know? The high surf also brings with it a beach hazard statement. Dangerous swimming conditions, strong rip currents, coastal flooding, and elevated surf are all possible at our local beaches. As a crane gets ready to lift each collapsed piece, Ducharme hopes the ocean won't tear down anything else. That's just the price you got to pay living on the, on the coast, you know? Now, I did speak with someone at the front office at the inn at Sunset Cliffs, but unfortunately, she said she could not comment on the situation at this time. Reporting live at Sunset Cliffs, Mimi Alcala, 10 News. Thank you, Mimi.